Isn't it? Aren't we a pair? I feel like I want to start all over, but I'm not going to. Me here at last on the ground. Yeah, I am going to start over because I like this song so much. Hi. Hi, everybody. I tried on a costume, and I think she's a little Tina Turner, a little modest Tina Turner. -ish. <laughs> I'm just glad I still fit in it for a minute. <laughs> okay. Isn't it rich? Aren't we a pair? Me here at last on the ground. You in mid-air. is hard. <laughs> Happy Pride. <sighs> I have cold tea today, so I won't have um, hot flashes as badly, hopefully. Oh, gosh. Okay. <clears throat> <sighs> 
Come on, let's just go for it. Let's just like crank it up. Let's crank it. <laughs> Hopefully. Maybe this time I'll be lucky. Maybe this time she'll stay. Maybe this time, for the first time, love won't hurry away. She will hold me fast. I'll be home at last. Not a loser anymore like the last time and the time before. Everybody loves a winner, so nobody loved me. Lady peaceful, lady happy, that's what I long to be. Something's bound to begin It's gotta happen Happen sometime Maybe this time I win Cause everybody, oh my friends Love a winner So nobody love me What I long to be When all the odds are There in my favor Something's bound to begin <laughs> I gotta work on that It's gotta happen Happen sometime Maybe this time Maybe this time I Yeah, something's bound to begin. I should just take it up the way she does it, but I keep trying to go, something's bound to begin, but it's better. Something's bound to begin. Yep, it, the climb is better. All right, there we go. I do need some tissue. I need a smart rocket. Here we go. Here we go. Um, get your chorus together. Ready? You're going to do this when we have the actual live encounter. Ooh, snot rocket. Okay. Hope I didn't get my hair. <laughs> my bushy wild hair right now. Oh my God. I'm just a weepy mess. Okay. Okay. All right. <sighs> um, let's do this. Let's keep going. Um... Get it up a little bit. I remember when, I remember, I remember when I lost my mind. <laughs> Something to say is pleasant about that place. Whoops. Even your emotions had an echo in so much space. Mm -hmm. And when you're out there without care, yeah, I was out of touch. But it wasn't because I didn't know enough. I just knew too much mm, Does that make me crazy? Does that make me crazy? Does 
that make me crazy Possibly I'm pushing too hard, I'm gonna back it up And I hope that you are having the time of your life But think twice That's my only advice Come on now, come on now, who do you, who do you, who do you think you are? I'm making my own words up. Ha, 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 bless your soul. You really think you're in control? Well, I think you're crazy. You think I'm? I think you're crazy. I think you're crazy. Just like me. My heroes had the heart to lose their lives out on a limb. And all I remember is thinking, I want to be like them. Mm. Ever since I was little, ever since I was little, I looked like fun. And it's no coincidence I've come And I can die when I'm done Maybe I'm crazy Maybe I'm crazy Maybe I'm crazy Hi, Deborah Bryant. Hi, Maria. Hi, everybody. My goodness. Is everyone behaving? I haven't seen anything weird yet. That's good. You know what they did? They totally took my video down. Dang it. They took my video down that I did live last week. Said that I, I broke some community rules. Ch -ch 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 -ch. What? 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 All right, um, let's try this. Howdy. <clears throat> Some of them want to abuse you, some of them want to be abused. Hey, 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 hey. That was terrible. Stop judging, stop judging. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Sweet dreams are made of these. Who am I to disagree? I traveled the world and the seven seas. Everybody's looking for something Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. 
Uh oh, I start to see something. Sweet dreams are made of these. Who am I to disagree? Travel the world and the seven seas. Everybody is looking for something. Sweet dreams are made of these. Who am I to disagree? Travel the world and the seven seas. Everybody's looking for something. Who am I to disagree? 425. You little hacks. Whatever. Everybody's looking for something. Dreams are made of these. Who am I to disagree? I travel the world and the seven seas band. Everybody's looking for something. This is the personnel band from commenting on this stream. Not again, I know, I know, I'm sorry. I'm not. This one out, band. I can't band fast enough, this is crazy. Just try to ignore those little stinkers. Mm. Here, this is a great song. I used to sing this in the back of the bus with my best friends, Laura and Letty. We also used to pretend that the ends of, uh, what are they called? Um, what are these called? Crutches were our dinglings as we sang. They, we used them as microphones and fake dinglings. Right up the road And 
I'll share your load If you just call me If you need a friend Late at night if you need to, honey All day, all night Call me, my friend Call uh, me Sorry Call me Ben Don't call the Greeks They'll send in the trolls <laughs> Wait, I see I need a scarf. That must be Carol. I bet that's Carol. It is. I need a scarf. Moustache lovingly from you, please. Okay, I got you. I got you. But you stop sending me them passive aggressive messages just straight up. It hurts my feelings. I don't like that you tell me that I sing off key. That that really like I'm trying so hard to sing. And I know that I miss beats, but I don't need someone else to tell me that stuff over text, especially when I've already like told you, stop, you're filling out my phone and I need my phone for my business and my phone is dying. It's on its last legs. So hang in there. I'm going to send you the scarf. I'm going to send all kinds of stuff. I have so many packages and I just like to design every single envelope. So I promise you, I haven't forgotten you at all. Are you kidding? My life will not move on until I send everyone the things that I owe them and thank them. So just know, like, I am really, truly trying to cre clean up the wreckage of my past and present. I am going through everything. I have been inventorying my life. I am seeing a therapist. I am working so hard, and I am so very grateful. Ow! Dang, a fly just bit me. That sucks. I don't like biting flies. <sighs> All right. Let's keep going. Um, you know what I'm going to try again? Let me try this one. I haven't thought of Let me get my flute. Hang on. It's such a short skirt, I'm afraid I'm going to flash it. Let's try it. Let's try the um, Doris Day Fly Me to the Moon thing again. Yeah? Let's try it. Okay. Keep your hands down. Yeah, fuck you. Bye, man. Um, all right, all right. I'm going to just, I'm, gonna, I'm not even going to look at that feed. I'm going to trust that I will see you guys when I need to see you. Let's try Fly Me to the Moon. Let's try it. This is a good one. What spring is like on Jupiter and Mars? In other words, hold my hand. In other words, darling, kiss me. Fill my heart with song and let me I long for all I worship and adore. In other words, please be true. In other words, I love you.
dee ba ba dee ba da boop. Bam. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, yeah, bam, bam. Bye bye. Bam. <clears throat> I just want to try some Etta James. They keep asking for this at uh, with some of my musician friends, so I want to see if I can crank it up a little bit. of 
everybody stay in one place anymore it would be so fun to see your face at my door doesn't help to know you're so far away Let's try this one. Dolly. You know the Greeks are coming to get me. Here you come again. Just when I've begun to get myself together, you waltz right in the door, just like you've done before. Wrap my heart round your little finger Here you come again Just when I'm about to make it work without you You look into my eyes And lie those pretty lies And pretty soon I'm wondering how I came to doubt you All you gotta do is smile In a little while, okay, off, messing up my mind and filling up my senses. Here you come again. Oh, key change. Looking better than a body has a right to, and shaking me up so that all I really know is here you come again. And here I go. There I go. Okay. I work on that one. <laughs> I work on that one. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, let's see. Bye, Ben. Bye, Ben. You guys are just fuck nuts. You're just a bunch of stinky poo-poo heads. That's what you are. You're a bunch of danglings with no life. You're just swinging around. You're like twat waffles. Just, <laughs> I don't know what to do with this thing. I don't know what to do with myself and all my misery. I go and shower it on somebody else. Um, all right, what else? I want to try just a little bit of this. I'm going to try a little bit. It feels very raw. <laughs> My mind is clearer now At last, all too well I can see where we all soon will be If you strip away The myth from the man You will see where we all soon will be Jesus, you started to believe the things they say of you. You really do believe this talk of God is true. And all the good you've done will soon be swept away. You've begun to matter more than the things you say. Listen, Jesus, I don't like what I see. All I ask is that you listen to me. And remember, I've been your right-hand man all along. You have set them all on fire. They think they found the new Messiah. And they'll hurt you when they find their wrong. I remember when this whole thing began No talk of God, then we called you a man And believe me, my admiration for you hasn't died But every word you say today Is twisted round some other way And they'll hurt you if they think you've lied Your famous son should have stayed a great unknown Like his father carving wood He'd have made good Tables, chairs, oak, and chest You'd have put in Jesus Ah! I'm a harm, I want alarm Listen, Jesus, do you care for your race? Don't you see we must keep in our place? We are occupied Have you forgotten how put down we are? I'm a frightened by the crowd for we are getting too loud And they'll crush us if we go too far If we go too far Ban 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 Listen, Jesus, to the warning I give. Please remember that I want us to live. But it's sad to see our chances weakening. But every hour, your followers are blind. Too much heaven on their minds. It was beautiful, but now it's sour. Yes, it's all gone sour. Oh, 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 Jesus is all gone sour. <laughs> all right. Uh, let's see. That was fun. I got to sit up. Oh, stretch. Okay. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me pull these girls up. Up. Stay up. <laughs>
normally, like for any kind of events, you just tape them in and then you push them. <laughs> push it. Push it good. The nice thing about having older boobies is they're very pliable. <laughs> Oh dear. All right. What should we do? What should we do? I kind of am in the mood for a little bit of Joni. <clears throat> Even though it's not Christmas, it still feels like I could want to sing. Let's try it. see me screw something up big time 
This is something I really, really want to get good, but I am so not good at it, but I just love her, and I have been putting it off and putting it off for one of our fellas, our fellow love bums. Hold on if I can find it. If I can find it. There we go. Let's try it. <laughs> I'm going to screw this up left and right. And then I'll probably cut out early and take this dress off because it's itchy. <laughs> right. You know I love music. And every time I hear something hot, it makes me want to move, make me want to have fun. But it's something about this joint, this joint right here, this joint right here, it makes me want to, woo, let it go. Can't let this thing called love get away from you. Feel it right now. I wanna do I gotta see it. Ugh. Ah, I'm just curious. No time for moping around. Are you kidding? No time for negative vibes, cause I'm winning. It's been a long week and I put in my hardest. Gonna live my life just a good. When I'm walking past the mirror, don't stress through the night. And <laughs> I gotta have to screw this up, Deborah. Damn it, I keep trying, but I screw it up. I'm terrible at it. I get so panicked. It's like, you know what it is? It's like, it takes me back to like the trauma of math class and having to stand next to the next desk. And, and, and someone could ask me the most simple, you know, two plus two is four. And I would just panic because it was right there on the spot to get this thing. And I know how fast it is that I panic ahead of time and I just can't see. I can't see it fast enough and sing it fast enough. I'm sorry. I will get to Mary J for you. I promise you I will. It really will. It is hard. It's hard and it's fast. <laughs> so like, I don't know. Sometimes I just like need to face plant myself in front of everybody. <sighs> oh. The most beautiful grandma I have ever seen. <laughs> I'll take it. I mean, you know, I'm about to turn 50. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Let's see. Let me just do one little acapella and, and just settle down. I'm going to go and... Um, get cozy clothes on again. I'm ready to get out of this dress. I feel like such a drag queen right now. Mm. All right. Um. What can we do? I have not seen Pinky, but I'm pretty sure she's nesting. And, um, yeah, and there are bunches of little babies, like fledgling birds. I have a blue jay's nest right outside this window here. And probably in about a week and a half more, the eggs will be hatched, I think, maybe. maybe. I think so. Yeah, I have to check my calendar, but... Um, um, oh my gosh, did you guys see in the news, somewhere I've read this, like... Brad Pitt accuses Angelina Jolie of like selling the winery while they're going through custody problems. I'm like, my God, dude, like seriously, you're a multimillionaire. You have what? Seven cars, nine houses. You could go into any winery anywhere and probably have a free drink. You are the king of the boys club. Get over it. <laughs> seriously, get over it. Who the freak cares? Wah, wah, wah. Stop working for assholes like Tarantino and behaving like a man who kills his wife and makes it funny. Bullshit. Bullshit, Brad Pitt. Bradley. <laughs> Call it Brad. Hi, Brad. Brad, you and I, we need to have a talk. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Like, really? Really? You're worried? You and your nine houses? And, oh my God. 
Hey, how much, I, I, I can't even imagine using that many places, that many cars and once, you know, like all these guys and gals, rich, you know, man hags too, where they just like a, a crew and a crew and a crew and a crew. <sighs> oof, oof. Anyway, blah, blah, blah. let's do this. They're still here. How much do you want to give you to shave it? Oh, you're such an idiot. If I should stay, I would only be in your way. So I'll go, but I know I'll think of you every step of the way. And I will always love you. I will always love you. Yeah, I think I stop. I just stop. I can feel myself a little agitated and I'm really trying to stay regulated. <laughs> and I don't, I don't want to, I just don't want to fight. There's some weird stuff. There's just some weird, weird energy. It's full moon. It's the aftermath of the full moon too. Oh my gosh, there's one other thing I was going to share with you guys. One, Well, one, I have this recurring, this butterfly keeps coming around the deck and just stays on the deck all like afternoon. It's so beautiful. Um, and my phone was overheated, so I, I missed the opportunity to get the, the video, but I'll try to capture it. And then um, I've been studying so much on healing from trauma and complex PTSD and childhood PTSD and... You know, just the whole nine, like studying all kinds of people, men and women. And I happened to come across someone who was absolutely familiar to me. And I realized that this woman uh, met with me after I had heard her speak somewhere. And I asked her if she would be my spiritual mentor. And I remember I met with her in her car and she wanted to hear my story. And so I told her a bit of like my trauma and things, you know, and she wanted to hear more. And so we got, um, after our meeting in the car, I called her later. She gave me a time to call her and I did. And we went through, like, she wanted to hear it all. And I gave it all to her as much as I could, like just a mess, you know, just talking through all the stuff, all the stuff, letting it out, letting out and letting her know, like, this is it, you know, this is what I've dealt with. And she said, okay, great, I'll talk to you tomorrow and we'll move forward from there. And then I guess less than an hour later, she called back and um, she said, you know, I'm just too sick. I'm too sick to take on someone like you. Um, you're just too much for me right now. And um, I was just like dumbfounded. And um, now this woman has like a YouTube channel on guiding people out of trauma. And I was traumatized by her. Like she totally just said, I was too much. Like you never say that to someone after they've shared all of their stuff, like the molestation, the, you know, the beating. I know, I know, just insane. And here she is like this, you know, big personality on on YouTube that I actually study. And honestly, I get a lot out of. <laughs> I mean, it's amazing. Like, um... I'm grateful. I'm grateful that I can still look at her and hear her words and write down notes on things that work for me and don't, you know, like she really does talk about a lot of stuff that I agree with. You know, I feel like I truly have been a leaky cauldron of hurt stew for everyone, you know, and, um, and that's something I'm trying to zip up and put more in the art and less in my talks now and get past the trauma, not dwelling, not staying on it, not talking it all out sometimes and going to other modalities like EMDR, like tapping, um, stuff with my therapist, meditation, uh, prayer, journaling, all of this stuff, you know, and art, you know, uh, music of course too. Um, but I thought I was just like, oh my gosh, how fascinating, how freaking ironic that, that revealed itself to me. Um, and then, oh my gosh, 
I just say like my my sister and I spoke the other night. We had such a a great conversation. It was just so nice to speak with her. And um, she sent me a picture, two pictures of my mother, our mother. And um, oh my God, it's so pretty. I'm going to post it up here because you guys got to see this. It's like her in her nursing outfit when she got her nursing pin and everything. And um, it's just a beautiful photo of her. Like, so it was just a, a very, very strong woman, you know, very strong for someone like, for someone who could run a hospital and see dying people every day and handle that, you know, and see blood and guts and you know, I looked through all of her books. Oh my gosh, she's just, um, I get more and more why she wouldn't be available to someone like me who is highly sensitive and extremely aware of so much going on that she didn't have time for that. She's got to get right to stat, you know, get this heart going and just was a different kind of thinker, you know, so bless her. You know, she didn't, she didn't know and she didn't, she just did what she could do as a person in this world. And, um, it's wonderful to feel so much love in my heart for her again and not feel so angry at my mother or my father's, um, and not feel so angry at my assaulters. Um, even though like my left hip is killing me right now, it's killing me. It's like so achy. I can't wait to get out of this dress and stretch it. <sighs> um, Retired from ER trauma, you get it. Yeah, exactly, Rhonda. Like there, there's different, there's different mindsets for people when they have that kind of career. Mine, as an actor, as an artist, I am a feeler. I'm going to feel everything from everyone. I'm going to look at all the behaviors, the sociology, what works, what doesn't, and all the ploys too. You know that we use as humans trying to connive our way through life. Uh, so I. I get it. Like you wouldn't want me to be there in the emergency room trying to drill a hole in somebody. <laughs> You'd just be like, Ugh. <laughs> oh, all right. Um, I'm so bummed that they took down my last live because I really enjoyed all of that music. So perhaps we'll put it up again. And this time I won't dance to music on the, uh, on the Lisa, my bad. Um, thank you so much for being here again. Thank you for um, hanging in there and recognizing the space is sacred just as I do. Really appreciate that. Really, really do. Okay. Oh, one last thing. I, okay. There's so much actually. My biological father called me out of the blue today and I'm excited. We're going to talk tomorrow. Um... That's something because I kind of ripped him a new one when I was right because he called right when I was going through it. And I, I finally uh, um, I finally told you guys about what had happened and started speaking up. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I have to work on my Jamaican accent, too. Yeah. Um, there's that. Oh, what else? OK. Um, oh, I was thinking like. I don't want to use parties over good night. I like it. It's fun. And it, it's, it harkens back to May 7th when I was tripping my balls off. However, I would really like to say instead of parties over, let's keep the party alive in our heart and in our art. How about that? So rock and roll. Let's keep the party alive in our hearts and in our art. And I'll see you soon. Um, I was wondering why nobody was writing me to give me their addresses. And I realized I didn't post, it didn't post the, um, the list of all the names. It should have posted two weeks ago and it hasn't. I'm like, what the hell? I thought I was starting to think in my mind, um, people don't want, <laughs> they don't want my pictures. <laughs> they don't want the aerialist stuff. <laughs> They're over me. They're like, no, nope, no, nope, don't even bother. <laughs> I don't even need it for a dartboard. But I realized that I did not actually send the, the actual, it didn't post the list. So, um, I will do that again, hopefully by tonight and, um, uh, we'll get that party or we'll get that, uh, ball rolling. Yeah. Okay. That is all for now. Thank you so much. I'll be in touch soon. Blessings. Oh, one of my wonder worms, John. Oh, my wonder worms are calling. Uh, hopefully, um, hopefully we'll have a band practice this week. I'm so excited. I love these guys. They're good hearted. 
fellas. That's another thing. Like, oh my gosh, John is like, he's like a dad. He's just like dad energy for me. It's so sweet. Like he's just a good old guy. And I feel so safe with these fellas. It's like the nicest thing ever. Um, you would love a picture of me and Drea. Okay. Yeah. And I probably will have some left from whatever the list is. And then I'll, I'll send them, you know, I will, I'll send as much as I can. I just want to make sure that I get it to the people that I've owed that I clear that because that was my big old, you know, screw up and letting, you know, just letting my life completely get compiled and compiled. So it's like this giant conglomerate of trash puppets and boxes and bags. Like remember Ruth, when you helped me open those, um, those paychecks, I got so distracted. I packed them away and then I forgot to even cash them in. I actually still have to, um, write to them to get them to resubmit them to me <laughs> like crazy stuff where it's just like even when I need money I have it but I can't get to it <laughs> oh yeah okay so there's that um if you want to donate and you want to make sure it gets to me you may absolutely use my Venmo that used to belong to my la my uh, legal name, Tracy Dash Dinwiddie. It is a picture of me on a swing set upside down on the set of touch or no, on the set of, um, oh God, stuff. And you're welcome to donate that way. If you don't want to do, um, go fund me, but I will be, uh, making sure that that stuff gets fixed, taken care of. Otherwise I'm just going to delete that particular um, go fund me and start all over because something is missing in my information underneath it all. I've given them everything like the bank statements, the whole nine. And for whatever reason, it's just, it's, um, it just keeps looping me back to the same problem and never fixing it. So, all right. Yo, chill, baby. We got you. <laughs> all good. All good. Thank you for your letters. I know I'm just trying to make sure I think of everything you guys, I'm just so grateful. I'm so grateful that I have a chance to heal and get better and sing and embrace my place now, embrace my home up here on this mountain and embrace my fellows. Like I feel like for the first time since Wilmington, North Carolina, that I have some sense of a community building here that everywhere I've gone, every day that I've been, left the house, people have said hello to me. And it, and just come over to my table to say hi. And I did, Donna, thank you. I did. Um, yeah. And it feels so good. And, it, and that's something that my therapist was really helpful in pointing out that I'm starting all over and I'm recreating support systems from scratch. And I was just like, yeah, I am. I really am. And, um, and it's happening. You know, it's happening. Like, I don't feel so alone up here. I know that I've got at least a couple nights where I have to be with these guys working on music. And it feels so good. <clears throat> and um, and then the kids, Oompa Loompas, came over yesterday and they were here for two hours and it was fantastic. They they were, <laughs> my littlest one was using the vacuum cleaner <laughs> like, a, like a pinata and beating the living poo-poo out of my um, last bit of costume racking I have up here. Look at this. All this shit. And, and it's totally loading up my lira. You see what I mean? All this crap. <laughs> oh, and you are loved too, Carol. I do love you. And I will be sending your thingy. Um, Deborah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right on. I'm back at you. Thank you for being on my witness and, and my sister friend. Um, if you cut my letter, please disregard I was being dumb. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay, well, no biggie. I appreciate the kindness and the letters. Oh, my gosh. The sweet gifts, the, the seeds, the greenhouse. I'm still leveling, but I'm going to get that up. And hopefully the uh, – I have a particular neighbor that's behind me that um, I prefer to call the parasols because she walks to her little – Peloton class is the, under a parasol umbrella coming up, you know, once in a while from this big city. <laughs> anyway, they have complained evidently about my house saying it looks unsightly or something. So I, I'm just careful not to put anything out there that would cause trouble. Um, I'm trying to play nice. 
And also, it's my damn house. It's my house. <laughs> Raw. <laughs> okay. Now, I'm going to practice saying our, our, our sign off. Okay. Rock and roll, you guys. Uh, nanu, nanu. And uh, let's keep the party alive in our hearts and in our art. Okay. See you soon.